So here we are. This is the last task in the Exploring Planet Earth module that we've put up for you this week. You Today you're going to look at global warming and climate change. So you might have already done some of this in geography or you might have done some primary school, you might have even done some last year. So you might already have some good ideas about this. Now the first task you're going to do is you're going to look at each of these pictures and you're going to describe what each one's showing. So what is this picture showing here compared to this picture here? What's this picture showing you? What's this here? and what is happening in this picture. You are then going to tell me what the link is between the four pictures, because they all link together for one specific reason. Now, on the next slide, you've got the big picture. So if we don't stop global warming, what is going to happen? In the next 100 years, we've got to see extinction of loads of different animals. We'll get bushfires, which we are already seeing, if you think about Australia recently, and we'll get drought, which means there'll be no water for us to drink. Now, here, the first part for you to do is watch the video. If you click on here, It'll take you to the video and you are going to answer these five key questions. If you click here, it'll take you to the answers. And once you get on there, you can kind of click your space bar and it'll give you all of the answers. Now, once you've done that, you have a written task to do. So you're going to read the information about the effect global warming and the video you watched earlier to describe the effect global warming has on the environment. So if you click on any of these links, they're going to take you to a Word document. So they're going to take you to a document that has some information that you can read about those different topics. You're then going to create a news article telling people about global warming and what the effect it's had on the environment. And you can talk about polar bears and you can talk about the effect it's having on food and how that will affect us and what global warming is. And you also have this checklist. So if you look at the checklist, these are the things you need to cover and these are the things you've got to include. And you've got to have things in there about how it affects the wildlife and food production. It should be a good few paragraphs long, so at least three paragraphs long. And you also have a useful website here. If you click on it, it goes to BBC Brightside. Now, once you've done that, the last little part is to have a look at these comics. And now what I want you to do is have a look at the four of them. Pick two of them and describe what's happening. What is the main point and how does it make you feel? So you've got this one here that has industry, so, you know, like, the factories and things then you have this one about the polar bears and drought you've got this one which is quite funny but has a serious point to it and you've got this last one now once you've done that you have completed all the tasks for the day if you have any questions please don't hesitate to comment or ask your teacher and i'm sure they'll be able to help you hope you enjoy the activities